Stone Church of Chicago, the house of faith. Amen. It was even prophesied to us that we wouldn't last six months. But it's been 21 years. So we thank God. To God be the glory. Amen. When God give you a thing, if he give you revelation, amen, it will manifest. We honor and praise his holy name. We honor him as uh, the King of kings and the Lord of lords. We honor him to be our Messiah, our Savior, our Lord, God's only begotten Son. And we believe with all our heart that God sent his only begotten Son. Amen. And the manifestation was him being the Christ child, born of a virgin by the name of Mary. And so we thank God for each of you. We thank God for our officers and leaders of Fivefold Ministry. We greet you with the Holy Word of Peace. Peace be multiplied. Amen. And thank God for our senior prophetess, Dr. Francis Person, to all the ministers and elders and teachers. Uh, it's just good to be here in the house of the Lord. Thank God for the awesome Sunday school lesson that we had on today. Amen. Awesome lesson. All of them are awesome. Thank God for those that attended. Uh, we thank God for, amen, the praise and worship that went forth. Amen. Elder Johnson and teacher uh, Eagle Tanya Posey and me and Elder McClendon jumped in there. Amen. And we praise God and gave us songs and Elder Anglin of, of, of praise and worship, adoration and exaltation. Amen. And so I just thank God. But I know that worship is something that we have to do individually. Amen. Amen. If you want to go there, you just have to lose yourself, your flesh, your mindset, mm -hmm. and go up higher. <laughs> oh, my God. And then one thing about it, you can't be thinking about somebody else when you get into your worship. Well, come on, so and so, let's go. No, ain't no reaching back. You, you reaching up. Amen. So God can all bring us up into those heavenly places. Amen. That we can receive just what we need. Amen. Anybody come out to the house to receive something from the Lord? Amen. And have a, amen, an expectation and a need. Amen. To be supplied on today. Well, I'm here to tell you, I got good news. He's able, and he's Jehovah Jireh. He's sovereign, and he knows just what we need, even before we ask him. But he wants us to ask him, amen. We got to really display, amen, true worship. Amen. Not no shape, form, or fashion, but true worship to the Almighty King. Thank God for those that made Sunday school today that haven't been here in a while. Some say they're going to press to even get here a little earlier. I say, I'm going to press to get here a little earlier, too. <laughs> yeah, come on now. We got to just be honest and, and just, amen. We, get, we can press a little harder. I told my wife, I'm going to make it to Sunday school on time today. But I was later than I was last Sunday. <laughs> amen. So I just should have said, I'm going to get to Sunday school. Maybe I would have got here at least like I did last week. Amen. So we just thank the Lord. Amen. That we're here in Jesus' name. Amen. I love God with all my heart. All my soul and all my strength. And I do love my neighbor as myself. So if we got to really hang those two laws on everything Jesus told as he, Jesus spoke. Amen. If you do those two things, you'll be doing well. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. No other God before him. And, and I don't know nobody just hate themselves. You got to love your neighbor as yourself. Do you love yourself today? Amen. Yeah. Hallelujah. <laughs> All right. I want to know if yeah. I'll, be, I'll be in the right house. We, we have to first love ourselves. Y'all get this on the internet. We, we have to first love ourselves. Not hate yourself, but love yourself. Then you can love your neighbors. Amen? Amen. We're going to go on with the uh, 
with the lesson today, what the Lord has given us.